this is Peter the Autobot here and welcome to a review video of Octopus and and Grimlock Grimlock Smash <laughs> Grand Rhymers Bumblebee Bumblebee and I don't have a clue what the other guy's name is. My friend thinks it's marriage but or marriage but no one knows. Profile Grimlock and Octopus. That's the colour Octopus in the one from one, two and three. I know he's half like the brownish like that, but why make it brown on the box but colour in the toy? Weird. So yeah. Weird. Exclusive to Asda. I never knew the way amazing Asda. So yeah, you get a nice Autobot symbol there. Octopus and Grimlock, blah blah blah. Hasbro and TransformersD.com. So let's have a look at Grimlock. Actually, we should have a look at Octopus first. I'd say it's the smallest. So this is Octopus Prime. This is head sculpt. Um, and see the truck um, parts, but he hasn't got a backpack, which is quite nice. Because I think it is like that on the movies. He's got, but it has got a cross there. But never mind, it has got a little cross. But still, of course, you can see it's a very little toy, so you can see a lot of the truck. There's these back wheels. There's the front part of the truck just there. Yeah. You see his um smoke stacks, his head, good guy do 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 um nice autobot symbol there on him. There. So yeah, he's got quite a nice robot. So let's transform him. The first thing you want to do is take the feet, push them down. Same with this one. You don't want to click them in yet because then it'll stop it from twisting. So you take back, twist it around. And then you can click these in. Like so. Take this bit here. Push it down, puff his head in, so you just need to push it like that. Then you see those silver bits there on the side of his truck? Take that, Take, bring it around the line there, you click the wheels into there. Same with this one, silver bit back, silver bit back. Silver bit back there, then you click it in like the other one, then you click at the bottom like that. So there you are, Optimus Prime in his vehicle board, or I should say, truck board. Get some nice flames at the front. Look quite nice because I'm looking at the camera right now, and it looks like the glowing, so yeah. Look quite nice. Where's his lights though? He has no lights. Just like full truck. I'm sure you'll get pulled over for that. Yeah. There he is with Bumblebee in his uh, robot mode. Ah, flipped him over. Oh, sorry, I forgot to show him in, him in robot mode next to Bumblebee. They are quite small though. Compared to Bumblebee. So, yeah. Down to Octopus again. And here he is with Grimlock. Sorry. And see the huge size comparison. I don't think you can get a trailer for this, guys. Sorry. But. 
It's a shame I couldn't mold in a little auto or two more, but not a big complainer. This is probably the best Transformer Octopus I've ever seen. I like the transformation. It's big it's better than my big one I think. So yeah. Uh, check that video out, the one that's my big one. So yeah, just go down to Grimlock. Here's Grimlock. It's no in his dino mode. Of course you can see his robot face in there but you can't see it that much. You do get a bit of mouth movement, but not quite a lot. Can someone please tell me which one this is? Is this G1? Because this looks quite a lot like a G1, I think. But I don't understand it. If we've got a G1 toy when it's not a G1 on the packaging, it's the movie. So yeah, I don't have a clue. So. Nice head sculpt. Again, I don't know which one it is. Arms, you clearly robot arms. Feet, bend, head movement. You can't you look up, but then it sort of reveals his robo head. Tail, where's his sword? Tail, proper tail. Um, the foot movement, you can move up and down. So yeah, let's go down to transformation. First thing you want to do, pull his legs down. Same with the, the second one, with the first. So like, he gets a taller Grimlock. Grimlock, tall. Tall Grimlock, tall Grimlock. So then you need to split the tail. Like that, unplug the sword. Chuck it over there. Then the second thing you want to do with the tail is just bend it like that to make it like this. Then you need to take the feet, make it the way you want it, take the arms, the elbows, pull, and push the head down. And there you have Grimlock in his war mode. Yeah. Angle the hands the way you want them. Sorry, forgot about that. There's Grimlock in his robo mode. Of course, you can see the head at the back, but still, it'd be much better if you'd split the head and stick the one with his arm there, his shoulders, and that'll make it look a, look a lot better. So you'd like split it, then push it down to there. But still, you can't do everything. Sword, that's the tail. There's the plug that plugs in the tail right there. Not much detail, you get a little stripe. So it'll hold it in his hand, it's not just a plug it in. You take it to the tail, push it over, then you can hopefully put it in his hand. There you go, it's in his hand. Yeah, let's have a look at side comparisons with Octopus. Show a transform Octopus again to show you what they look like comparison. Yeah, I'll just do it really quick. There we go. So there's Oculus. Next to Grimlock. There you go. You can see the size comparisons. I don't know if the, um, the dinos are bigger than all the robots in the film, but I think they are because I've seen the trailer and Grimlock in his vehicle mode, which is, I should say, dino mode, is tons bigger. So, yeah. I think that's the end of this video guys, thanks for watching.
subscribe, like, comment, thanks for watching. Bye!